The Tier 4 engine in your Komatsu is at the leading edge of clean diesel power. Correct operator action is critical for keeping the Komatsu Diesel Particulate Filter, or KDPF, system doing its job. Here's what you need to know. Most modern diesel engines have a diesel particulate filter, or DPF, to stop emission particles from the engine being released into the air. The DPF captures these particles and periodically self-cleans by burning off the soot into clean gases. Komatsu's KDPF is the most advanced self-cleaning system available. Messages and icons on your machine's monitor panel will guide the operator, so getting it right is simple. Here's how. First, notice the soot level indicator. It's this graphic on the KDPF regeneration screen. A Dash 11 excavator monitor panel is shown here, but all Tier 4 Komatsu machines are similar. It shows the soot level on a scale from 0 to 8 bars. Up to two bars, the KDPF is burning off captured particulates through normal engine operation. That's called passive regeneration, and you can keep working as normal. At three bars, the engine will enter active regeneration mode, and this symbol appears. The KDPF is now treating exhaust gases and adding a small amount of diesel to more actively burn off trapped particulates. It's automatic, with no noticeable difference in performance. However, the engine and exhaust will run a bit hotter. Because of that, if you're working in or around combustible materials such as paper, wood chips or grain, it'd be safer to delay KDPF regeneration temporarily. To do that, go to the KDPF regeneration screen and press here. This symbol now appears. Don't keep delaying regeneration though, it'll eventually get clogged and you'll risk damaging the KDPF. At four bars, this symbol appears along with an L01 action level code. This is a request for manual stationary regeneration or MSR, and you'll need to run an MSR in your next break. To do that, move the machine to a safe location, away from the worksite, and in the correct parking position. In the KDPF screen, select Manual Stationary Regeneration and press the tick icon to start. If the soot level builds to six bars, the L03 action code appears. Now you must stop work, move the machine to a safe location away from the worksite and in the correct parking position, and perform an MSR immediately. If the machine is allowed to reach eight bars, the MSR function is disabled and a continuous alarm kicks in. Stop the engine now. The KDPF is damaged and requires immediate investigation by a Komatsu service technician. Be aware that for passive and active regeneration, the KDPF needs heat and engine RPMs. It works best when the machine's working hard, so don't idle for long periods. Follow the steps indicated by the icons and alerts. Don't ignore them or delay regeneration repeatedly, or you'll risk damaging the KDPF. When a manual stationary regeneration is required, do it next time you break for lunch or at the end of your shift and act immediately when an L03 or L04 code is displayed. Treat your KDPF right and it'll keep your engine running smoothly and your exhaust clean. Komatsu's Tier 4 specialists are there to help. Just call 1300 566 287.